Oh, uh, good grief. You said you saw another sunken ship? Yeah. Hang on. Off of where should I start doing it? And how far away does uh, it look? It's that way. And, you know, it's so it's, it's basically north from here and down. Well, yeah, I expected the down. How, how far away does it look? Um, at least as far as the um, Ocean Monument. Oh, I'll see if I can see either of them. Because if that one's got more iron, we just we just need a bit more to make some more hoppers for that iron farm, ideally. And hopefully there'd be an extra two for me to make make a sword. Because these stone swords just don't last. Mm -hmm. What on the earth is that? God, so many fish. See it at all from here. I don't have a ton with me, but can I get close enough that I can see it from up here? Oh. 
Oh. That's the... Yeah, that, that must be what she could see. Oh. Well, at least I've gotten most of the way to it. It's something, I suppose. Okay, let's definitely head back, though. Hello. The ship. Hello, the shipwreck was a bust. Aww. On the plus side, I can finally see the uh, uh, monument you were talking about. Oh, that's good. Downside, the cows refuse to give leather, I swear. I have managed to make two books, and one of those pieces of leather I got from fishing. We have a ton of steak, though. I guess not a ton, but still. Oh, by the way, from the, uh... La, oh. over here. I tossed down from the, uh, yep. On the upside, I literally just got the last piece of iron. We need to make three hoppers, which, for what we were hoping to make for the iron farm, is exactly what we need. How did the cow get in with the sheep? I found a cow out there walking on the on the pathway there. I think it may have just spawned. Must have. Guess what that cow that uh, I just killed gave me? Please. Two pieces of leather. Ah, uh, for I only need one more. Well, to be fair, I do need two more if I'm gonna make the enchanting table as well. Once we get some more diamonds, but I means I can. Yes, I can finally go work on the villagers. Yes, yeah. yes, yes. It's all coming together. I have way too many swords because. I made a bunch because I thought it was going to take longer to get that last piece of iron. Did I just put that iron away upstairs? I bet I did. I'm an idiot. No? Did I misremember how much iron we had? Or did I just put it somewhere weird. It's not in there. Oh, if I misremembered how much iron we have, that's going to be annoying. Oh well. No, not in there. Not in there. No, I must have misremembered and thought we had 14 mm. when we had 13. Oh well. One more piece of iron. If that's any indication, it won't take anywhere near as long as I was afraid of. First things first, I need to make a lectern. Excellent. Now I just need to go borrow my brewing stand. Oh, yeah, and I want to bring the stuff I need to trade. Okay, let's see. I figured I'd go check out the, uh, Aww. 
nether and see if I can see anything. Please do. You want me to go with you, or are you good? I mean, depending on whether if you want to come or not. I mean, I'm certainly curious to find out what there is. Hang on, I'm just going to harvest a little more sugar cane. Mm. Uh, well, I do definitely see some things. Oh. Well, There's a bastion that way. A bastion? Oh, good grief. As well as another ruined portal. Huh. Well, that's a good start. Let's see. Uh, I don't see anything that way or that way or that way. Just that way. Well, I mean, the others I might see if I walk down them a bit. That's up to you. Yeah. But yeah, there's a bastion over this way. Okay. If I spot anything, mm, no. Okay. So nothing to the south. A bastion to the east. Another fortress. <gasps> oh my goodness. To the west. Okay, east and west are good directions. Uh, I'm so glad you came to take a look. We are not prepared to take care of it right now, but we are definitely coming back. Mm -hmm. Especially after we get the iron farm going, because uh, we're probably going to want better than leather to mm -hmm. deal with it. I mean... But yeah, there's, a, there's another fortress that way. Oh... <sighs> It popped into view <laughs> pretty soon down the path. Okay, so it can't... I mean, it can be pretty far, but not that far. So we definitely need to go east, and we definitely need to go west. There's nothing to the south that we're aware of, so just gotta check north. Mm -hmm. See if it's worth our time. But, oh my goodness, that, that makes me so happy. This is a lot luckier than I thought. <sighs> Um, another nether fortress. Another two? One to the north and one to the west? Yeah, well, the one to the north is a little bit more northeast. I can see one of the paths. Okay. The other one was just directly, if we just keep going straight. Alright, so let's let's focus on east and west for now. Yeah. But, oh my goodness, a bastion and a nether fortress. That is a lot luckier than I was expecting, especially when I came out in a basalt delta. Okay. Which one? Which one? Honestly, if there's people in those, those would be the easiest. Should have.
I mean, I'll take it. work. I just need something similar for you. Is there a different bed I could steal, maybe? Because I want to get trading. Oh, never mind. mildly annoying. That's probably best case scenario, actually. Mm. Okay. Well... for a lot more trading with you, dude. You might let me come back sooner, though. Perfect. All right, that's the best I can get from now from you.
Hmm. Yeah, I'll get you leveled faster. And it, you do at least have glass. Oh, ink sacks. Hmm. That's useful. I'll be back, dude. Hey. Hello. It's off to a great start. Have a present. Ooh. I just needed to come back for more stuff to trade. So far, I've gotten the respawn anchor made. We'll need more glowstone still, but, you know, it's a good start. Ah. The librarian so far hasn't sold any books, but that's fine. We can't use them yet anyway. What we need are the utility, which they've got. They have a bookshelf trade, a paper trade. They just acquired an ink sack trade, so I'm bringing what we've got. Mm -hmm. Or at least what I've got that, that'll, that they'll actually buy. Mm-hmm. Um, and the just and he also just got a glass trade, so we can buy glass, and then obviously the lantern trade. He also buys books. That's less useful until we can get more leather, but still. Well, if he's got a bookshelf trade, you just break down the bookshelves and ah, but it's four books per emerald. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, a god awful return. But we need glass anyway. Or at least we were going to use glass for the iron farm, so that'll help. And I mostly just want to get him to master so we can get that uh, ever so elusive name tag so we can actually make the farm. So. Yeah. Yeah. So, yep, yeah, I came back to uh, farm up some more rotten flesh because that is definitely of the two options the better way to get uh, more emeralds to trade with the librarian and such. I mean, more paper will be good as well. I may as well keep the paper on me now that I think about it. And just, uh, you know, when the sugar cane grows, get more. Mm -hmm. Which it'll grow while I'm sitting there farming anyway. So, taking my excessive number of swords and uh, going to go whack some more mobs. Okay, let's nail down where we want this iron farm to be. I was thinking, uh, taking it off closer towards the, um, uh, the other, other temple. Yeah. Hanging it's, it out over that way. Yeah, and it's got to be far enough over that it's not going to, that, that it can't spawn, mm -hmm. uh, it's not close enough to spawn anywhere over here. So we think yeah. maybe going out from, like, this... Uh, bridging out from this house a ways, maybe? Oh, yeah. oh shucks. Too far away. Huh. You know what? Sorry. I, I, uh, I went out of hearing range for a moment there. I, I noticed. Oh, yeah. So, thinking maybe somewhere off of, like, this house, maybe? Because I need to yeah. make a, a bridge out to it. It's just going to be a low bridge so that it can't, nothing can spawn on it, you know? Yeah. So actually, yeah, this keep it at half slab. Yeah, this this level is indeed half slab. So if I just bridge out from here a bit, you think? Yeah. I think it's got to be like a minimum of ten blocks away. Minimum. So two, three, four, five. Six. I go fifteen or something just to be sure. Oh, this is 15 away. Mm. I, I've got 11 more slabs if you don't trust it. Yeah, go another 10. How's this? 
looks good. All right. Right. Hmm. Need some more slabs? Nah. I just gotta get creative. Hmm. Oh, shoot. Nah. I mean, I will need some more slabs, but I do have the crafting bench. I can, and some more stuff. I can just make a couple slabs. Not a big deal. Mm-hmm. And it's mostly just as, like, slabs. you know, a way to, I mean, I might not need any more slabs, hard to tell, but at least to, you know, be able to jump up and build to the high bits. Yeah. Some, some temporary stairs. Oh, shoot. Mm. Oh my lord. Precisely the right number. Oh my lord. I... Okay. We need to get them in there before I can put the lid on. And I'm not breaking the glass, obviously. So... Gosh dang it. I'm just placing all over the place today. Hmm. That is so precarious, but I don't know. I mean, I can make it too wide at least, but... Mm -hmm. Think we can get him over? Well, this was doubly frustrating. Um, Editor Spider, uh, again. Apparently, the 
a clip uh, toss that in there. Uh, around uh, getting the villagers in. Got a bit corrupted. I had like a system crash while it was happening. And mm -hmm. when I came back, the OBS wasn't working and I didn't realize it. Uh, but yeah, and it was took a really long time to get them in there. So yeah, uh, trust me, you didn't really miss anything but a little frustration. And uh, yeah, OK, I'll uh, get back into doing this stuff. <laughs> Good, 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 good. I can always add another chest later. Actually. Just so I can get out. Oh, that's the other thing I didn't bring. Oh. Bucket of lava. I mean, I can go back for it. It's just annoying, you know? Well, I may as well leave this uh, stair anyway, so I can get back up there to put in the lava. Yeah. But I may as well take a moment to put in the water. I think just one bucket of water. Yeah, that'll be plenty. Well, the good news is it works. Yeah. Don't even have a zombie in it yet. I go back up to put in the lava, and there was already a iron golem sitting there waiting to get burnt. Nice. So we already have an upshot of three iron. But yeah, so basically, I just... I mean, I can go see if there's a zombie in that... Um, Uh, already in that temple, perhaps. I've got a pathway I can lead it over to. Mm -hmm. uh, but, at, but if there isn't a zombie already in that building, then definitely just gonna ha I'm gonna take down the torches over there and... Oh! Mm -hmm. There's already another golem burning. I'm not complaining, I'm just, well, dang. <laughs> yeah. I'm not sure what they're terrified of, other than, I suppose, the apocalypse, but... <laughs> Maybe heights? <laughs> yeah, not that I've ever seen. I mean, if so, all these guys must be terrified. Probably. But, I mean, I'm still going to try and get the zombie. We want a good output if we can.
Mm -hmm. But yeah, if I just, since though, since that other bridge over there that I've connected it to is at block height, I just take out those torches and see if I can get some to spawn. Then have it follow me over there. If I break the glass so it can see them, it should go after them once it can't reach me, and then I can just block it in. At least that's the yep. plan. Here's hoping it works. <laughs> Why can't I name tag? I can't name tag him. Probably because the name tag doesn't have a name on it. <sighs> but I'm pretty sure you can. No, I think they do have to be named. The name tag has to be named. Uh, well, we can't do that without an anvil. Okay, well, for now, I'll put that slab back. Until I can name tag him. Yeah. Hopefully he'll still be there. Yay. What'd you name him? Husk. <laughs> ah, that'll work. That's what I was thinking. You'll want to put a slab on top thank of you, that. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. I want to get rid of that walkway. I was. Thank you. Sorry. I was just so happy it was over. <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, if you want to help me slab up the rest of this area. You bet. Just... I'm sure we're going to need more slabs. Yeah, I mean, I still got some um, cobble in my, my chest. Mm-hmm. So, you know, you're welcome to go grab it and make slabs of it. I will. I think you got it spot on. It is ever so mildly annoying that I cannot reach that little section under that little, you know, well area. I know. I you long have to, like somehow go underneath. The... Well, I'd I'd need a trap door, I think, because as long if I can get in a prone position, I can see, you know, to place. Mm -hmm.
Because I can get a few in here and there, but I can't get every angle. Yeah. But we don't have a trap door with us. No, well, no. to be fair, I could also just, you know, do a little of that. Yeah. Again, from farther away, I can see. Mm. Oh, well, lost a little sand, but we've got more sand. Yeah. There. Most all the stuff at the lower angle here is all going to come down anyway. My plan is with the terraforming, I'm going to terraform a nice incline right through here. Mm hmm And have down, down in this lower area, I'm going to put in more little houses like the ones that are already there. Yeah. Just add a whole bunch more just all around the edge for housing-wise. And then up here on this platform, kind of remove everything that's up here and put down um, workstations and stuff. Hmm. I like the idea of using the buildings as the wall to keep them safely inside the space. Yeah. I like that idea. Yeah, that way we only have to build a wall around the uh, around this upper perimeter. Yeah, this market area. And honestly, just a regular old sandstone wall will do the job. Yeah, doesn't have to be anything fancy. And while you're working on it, the iron farm will be chugging away. In fact, it already has been a little bit. I don't think there's that much left, but I'm curious. Yeah. I, cur I currently have 18 iron ingots here, and I know there's two back home. Nice. I'm going to take this, and there goes another one. I'm going to take this anvil and start making gear. Yay. 